here to show you how to fix the common problem <clears throat> when refurbishing and getting ready to paint your cabinets here we know it's a big hole in the center so I've known this trick for a long time what you do is you get a cotton ball with super glue and you put some cotton in there I'm gonna try to get it flat because you don't want to have to sand this a lot later and then you just put a little bit of super glue around in there. Make sure you don't super glue your fingers. And then to top it off, this makes it dry real quick. Hardens it up. I also use it to glue remote control dune buggy tires. So just crunch up a little bit of that baking soda into powder. Again, put your High quality super glue. Made for outside. Made for adventure. Plus burn coal stash. Shop Columbia and Coles. And poof. Dump it on there. Now you can touch it. Give it a second to dry. We rub it in. Now it's ready for sanding. And of course, since one's never good enough, we're going to do another one. And while I'm at it, I'm going to go back and fill in a little bit of the areas that need more. Yeah. Let's go ahead and So, after you repaired the large holes in the cabinets, now what you want to do is go ahead and use some uh, Dynaflex 230 almond color. Whoa, that's a little bit much. So, you don't want to do that. And if you put too much on there, just get your same cotton ball and go like that. Work it in. Fill in the holes. And voila. You're ready to go. It's ready for painting. And after painting, there you have it, folks, the finished product. Stay tuned for more, and please remember to hit the like button.